this is the envelope you get. It has nothing in it when you get it. If you've ever wondered what a PhD in astrophysics looks like, this is literally it. I've been doing a lot of inward looking lately. As I've mentioned before on this channel, this year I'm making some big career decisions. I'm trying to decide how much further my journey in academia goes. Right now I have this relative moment of stability where I, my job is secure and I know what I'm doing. And I've got great students and colleagues to work with. But no matter which way it shakes out, change is coming. I'm, so I'm trying to use a lot of this time to look inward and really try to unpack and understand some of my unaddressed issues with this career. And let me say, I'm sharing this as catharsis for myself. By setting up a camera and a microphone, I'm forcing myself to process this and think about it. And before we go any further, let me also just acknowledge that I have been absolutely, completely, unreasonably lucky and privileged in my life. These are the most first world problems to have, and I'm super aware of that. But I have some very complex emotions about this job and this life and the path that's brought me here. One real physical manifestation of these weird emotions, that this is, I think, only the second time I've seen this degree. I received it in the mail, I looked at it for a few minutes, and then I stuck it in this folder. I literally have a box full of diplomas that I can't bear to look at. And I'm not trying to brag or be proud of how callous I am about these things. These pieces of paper bring me weird, complex emotions that I haven't known how to deal with. Same mix of anxiety and imposter syndrome and shame and survivor guilt. Mixed with pride and excitement, I've really had an amazing career so far. I've been able to realize in myself so many things that I've wanted to do so far, and that's a huge blessing. So I don't know what's next. I certainly don't know what the next job I'll have is. I'm applying to some things and putting my name in some hats, and if I get lucky and I can stay in academia, Astrovlog, you will be the first to know. Either way, I know I have to come to terms with these pieces of paper that have both defined me and my career and haunted me. No profound conclusion, no awesome time-ups of me putting these in new frames, though I'm gonna go look on the internet for some cool frames. I've never really heard anybody else talk about these kinds of feelings with regard to their diplomas, but I imagine, or maybe I hope, that it's not that unusual. So if you're feeling like this, if those diplomas are hiding in a box somewhere, I don't have an answer for you. But I hope you can think about this and work on it too.